To say that I'm crazy about you doesn't do my feelings any justice. I adore you. I'm devoted to you. You would make me the luckiest man on the planet if you would be my wife. Eh. What does that mean? Huh? What's that? Did you get her father's blessing yet? No, it's not a father, it's her brother. Hey, get down, boy! You got two seconds before I'm involved. You're white! You're white! You don't fight! That's that little clown that's dating my sister. Little man smurf. Maybe he just wants into the family. I know exactly what he wants. You want the hammer? I want the hammer. You go get the hammer. Okay, enough of that nasty. <laughs> Baby, no, 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 no. Do not screw this up for me. I love him. Hey. Oh, damn, it's Sir Scream a lot. I was responding to a hostile situation, James. That was a high pitched scream. James, you know what? You. Wow. Is he still staring? Make mm -hmm. him stop. James, I wanted your blessing in asking your sister to marry me. Show me that you're worthy of her. How am I supposed to do that? I'm gonna take you on a ride along. Hell yeah. That's the song that I want to Today is your training day. Have you ever even held a gun before? Bang, bang. I'm more of a shotgun specialist. Be careful, that's got magnum loads in Oh, yeah. You better get out of here! <laughs> my stomach in my ass. Oh, yeah, you ready for the streets. <laughs> you better be lucky it wasn't me. <gasps> James, you broke the glass. Officer, officer, officer. Rules out here. Don't touch no perk unless you're bringing them in. You guys think you're tough because you're the little gang? I'm the definition of tough. Be afraid! Oh! Yo, I'm gonna chop you on the neck! Right. How'd that work out for you back then? I think it would've worked out a lot better if I would've had a gun. Tell me what I buy it! Tell me what I buy it! He shot me! Oh. Yeah, he shot your ass! You damn right I shot your uh -huh. ass! Man, you got to be kidding me. You gonna pull out a gun when you looking at this? Get down, baby. I didn't, I didn't know it was this much of a height difference. Thank you. I'm gonna tip you. Get 100 ones. I got you in a second. Check it out. It's your boy Hip Hop Gamer. First off, ride along. The experience was crazy, all right? So I flew out to LA. Good flight. You know, it was real nice. Landed. Hotel room. We got the SLS. Crazy. Beverly Hill status, right? So next morning after I get my good sleep, Go right downstairs, we go to the room. Yo, shout out to Console Kings, man. They had this big, giant, 80-inch, sharp Xbox One was hooked up to this TV. We had Call of Duty, and we had NBA 2K14, and we had some other monitors set up for multiplayer, so already, like, it had that gamer feel, like, the moment you walk in, so that was cool. They had a step and repeat, Console Kings, and, you know, um, Ride Along movie. Everybody walking in, it was great. Beautiful ladies, dude. Where I turn the hat back with some. When I tell you, I made I made sure the hazel eyes came out. Like it was crazy, all right? So we had beautiful ladies. Everything was good. Nice hospitality. But here's the part that like took this took it over. When my man Lou Peanut walked in, and you know Lou Peanut, he's the one saying, "What you going? You know what I'm gonna do? Grow? What you gonna do? Stretch that part?" Lou Peanut held it down. But the cool thing about Peanut is that this dude actually box. He actually raps, and he's good at both, as well as being an actor. So I got a chance to sit down with him. We had a nice live stream. Shout out to Twitch TV for organizing that. So we up here talking, having a good time. He put the belt on. It was crazy. It was amazing. Shout out to my boy TT from BET's The Game. He came through. We spoke for like 45 minutes. We was commentating on the NBA 2K match that was going on. The event was crazy. It's like we really need more events like this to represent movies and games and just the overall brand. So we spoke with him for a while. He actually had a new daughter. So congratulations to him. We got a chance to really bond. So that's great. Future things coming. You know how hip hop game would do. You know how we do. But last but not least, my man Kevin Hart came. Now, first of all, when I see Kevin, I was like, yo, Kevin was good. And I stood up, I was like, it felt so good to feel tall around people. Like, word up, because I'm only like 5'7", you know what I'm saying? So, Kevin Hart saw him, and like, he's one of those comedians that's funny without even trying to be funny. Like, you know what I'm saying? It just comes natural for him. So, we up here talking, having a great conversation. He told me a story about how he was afraid Ice Cube might like, whip his ass on set. It was amazing. So, in terms of the overall recap of the event, it was a lot of love. The director's... The director showed up, you know what I'm saying? The producer showed up. It was a real gathering event full of love, gaming, and just excitement. You know what I'm saying? Everybody came out, flew out. It was beautiful, you know what I'm saying? So that's my take on the event. I wanted to go to another one right now. I'm that hype. Ride along January 17th. Make sure you check it out. Now, to move into my overall thought process on the movie, I gave you guys my initial impressions, right? And the movie's crazy. 
But this is like my little, I would say like my mini review of the joint. Now, I really think that this is, if you're a fan of Lethal Weapon, if you're a fan of Bad Boys, if you're a fan of those type of like dynamic duo type of movies, Ride Along fits in line with, with the greats, you know what I'm saying, for this generation right now. That's what this movie do, like, does. I really feel like we, had a, we actually had a round table where we got a chance to talk about um, Ice Cube and Kevin Hart and... Yo, you know me, dog. I'm going to bring up the hard questions. And I brought it up. Ride along, too. Or is this a franchise? What's up? And you know what? They didn't rule it out. And depending on the success of this movie, you guys got to go check it out. But we may see you ride along, too, with some new characters to be introduced. Like, that's how good this movie was. And once again, the authenticity of the gaming factor, throwing the grenades, picking up ammo. Yo, this joint is crazy. And shout out to Ice Cube for still being dope boy in that movie, Boys in the Hood. He did a, yo, you, got, you just gotta see it, man. Trust me, it's crazy. So now to end it off, like the whole like gaming aspect, like the whole recap of the event and the overall movie itself, like that trifecta, yo, it's it was one of the best experiences of my life, man. Then after that, I flew my ass back to cold ass New York. And look, can't wait to do it again. So Ice Cube, Kevin Hart, Console Kings, Universal, the whole team, man. God bless you guys. It's your boy Hip Hop Gamer. And that was my that was my adventure. <laughs> it's your boy Hip Hop Gamer. Welcome to the Loud Digital Network.